Hello guys, welcome to Survival Russia. So as you can see, it's a little bit chilly today. It's like minus 20, close to minus 20. But uh, you know, I'm here at the homestead all the time and uh, we almost have daylight today, it's pretty awesome. So uh, let's get the hunting skis on. At this time of year when the snow starts to build up and so on, uh, you don't really walk that much or go anywhere. I have some game trails out here. I think we're gonna go and put a few uh, trail cams up to see if we can catch something. So uh, yeah, let's get the hunting skis on and uh, shotgun loaded up and stuff like that. And let's see what the day's gonna bring. Here we are on my field, my land. It's quite a big area actually. I have optimized for the driving glasses. But this is not a hunting trip as such. It's just first and foremost breaking the trail. It is what it is, you know. But uh, yeah, let's move on. Brand new snowshoe hair tracks going in that direction. It's most likely running away from the sound of me. Heading to safety into the forest. Smart little guy. <laughs> 20 meters later, another one. But in that direction, this little fellow here moving much, much faster than the other one. There's like two meters or six feet between each track or imprint. At the moment we are hiking along the road, you can see on the drone footage, so there might be some road sound, but what can I do? <laughs> road out there was made like 20 years ago or something. We got our first supermarket last year. So here's my big pond, a small lake that I made the fish trap video in. I can link to that up in the corner somewhere. Gonna have to be a fox looking for something in there. Two o'clock, first of December, sun's going down. <laughs> Daylight is pretty precious here at the moment, I'll say. Anyway, here we have a little bit uh, better look at things. <clears throat> we have this nasty wind, it's not so awesome. So, excuse me if there's any wind noise. There's basically the homestead up there. Down there is where I made the bow drill and the magnesium fire. You can link to those videos and check them out. I suppose New Forest looks like my, my facial muscles are frozen. <laughs> Breaking the trail, I think we're gonna head out there now and then turn back. So when the trail is broken, my travel on the hunter skis here will be faster and it will be much more silent. Hunter skis here, awesome concept. It's much better than uh, snowshoes. From a military point of perspective, <sighs> Snowshoes are best for hauling uh, heavy loads and so on. Hunter skis are awesome for travel in an environment like this, especially on four feet of snow or about one meter. Down here we have a good little example of animals actually using ski tracks as a travel route. You see down there, it's my old ski tracks. This looks to be a fox. I actually seen quite a lot of fox around here. So yeah, it's possible to trap in uh, ski tracks actually. Also snowshoe tracks, but uh, ski tracks are really good at it. I didn't came around to that last year, so uh, I think we're gonna do that soon. Snowshoe hair, snaring and ski tracks, hopefully. Let's see about that. Let's move on, get the camera set up. So here's another look at the property on the west side of the homestead. 2.30, bye bye son. I think we're gonna head in there, there's a tree line in there. Set the cameras, get home and get some tea and stuff. And uh, start the oven and all that good stuff. <laughs> See, cheeky snowshoe hair. Running in full flight this direction. Only to stop over there and turn around. Backwards. See what else it is. That's a weird looking snowshoe hair trail. How the hell did he make that? It's a low crawl or something. Let's set a trail cam here to see how it goes. First came up there. It's a Simmons. It's from Fred in Canada. Thank you, Fred. Let's let it sit there for a few days and let's see what's gonna happen. So there we have a little inexpensive Primo sitting, filming in. This direction. See what it can come up with, just for the fun of it. Not too much going on in this video here. 
Also, I'm testing the Mora Cansball cross draw setup. Works really awesome. But yeah, since the trade has been made, we can take a few rounds now and then during the week and uh, see if we can bag some snowshoe here. I mean, if you don't get out there, nothing will ever happen, right? Now I want to go home and get some tea. And uh, guys, please check the links in the description and sub share and subscribe and sub like and all the good stuff. So until next time, guys, get out and train and get it done. And see you next time here in wintertime, Russia. Thank you very much.